What is up guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Suman and today's analysis video is going to be about the new signing of Chelsea, Adwa Mendy. So Chelsea completed the signing of Adwa Mendy in the summer of 2020 for a reported fee of £22 million. Mendy has made 16 appearances for Chelsea this season and he has kept 10 clean sheets in just 16 games. Passing has become a big part of a goalkeeper's gameplay, especially for teams that likes to build their play from the back. Mendy has an average passing accuracy of 86.1% in all competitions, which ranks him amongst one of the very best in Europe. Just to get an idea of Mendy's passing ability, here's a list of some of the top ball playing goalkeepers and their passing accuracies. Ter Stegen has a passing accuracy of 79.9%, Anderson 78.8%, Ellison 78.1%, and Manuel Neuer has a passing accuracy of 77% in all competitions. One of the biggest issues that Chelsea had with Kepa was Kepa's inability to leave the line to catch or punch the ball away from the danger zone. Kepa hardly ever left his line to catch or punch the ball and that was one of the main reasons why Chelsea were failing to defend the corners and set pieces last season. Mandy on the other hand is 6 feet 5 inches tall and he is not afraid of leaving his line to catch or punch the ball. Mendy has only conceded 7 goals in 16 games, that is 0.43 goals conceded per game. Mendy has faced a total of 38 shots on target and he has saved 31 of those shots, which makes his save percentage 81.57%, which again is a very impressive number for a goalkeeper.
you guys might remember that I made a video on Mandy before he joined Chelsea. And in that video, I spoke about Mandy's weakness as a sweeper goalkeeper. Let's try to rewatch the clips from my first analysis video and then we will see what Mandy has done at Chelsea. Out of the total 7 goals that Mendy has considered so far, two were down to his weakness of effectively sweeping the ball. Hopefully the Chelsea coaching department can help Mandy to improve his decision making so that he can make better decisions of when to come out and when to stay in the line. Overall, Mandy has turned out to be one of the best summer signings of Chelsea and he is also one of the main reasons why the Chelsea defense is looking so good this season. Thank you so much guys for watching the video, I hope you guys enjoyed it, please don't forget to like and subscribe.